Today I would like to talk about my beloved LSL Satikoi. <music> Things I really like about it is, first of all, the playability. The back of the neck feels just like a ride for my hand. If I'm not wrong, Carl Verheyen has a um, 1957 Fender Strat where Lance uh, or Mr. LSL Instruments uh, took to uh, make this one uh, and possibly most of the Satikoi models. You know, it's just a great workhorse. I know uh, it's kind of a head-to-head -to -head to, uh, with um, a Fender Custom Shop. Some purists would say, well, we stick to a Fender. Um, I, I love Fender Strats. Uh, I love Telecasters, I love Gibsons. I mean, even cheaper guitars get the job done. It's all about the fingers at the end of the day and the taste and what you put on it and the time, right? But uh, if you can afford something nice, you know, um, why not? Uh, this guitar came to me as a deal uh, because I was in LA at the time, so I actually met the people from the custom shop, um, getting to visit the factory and, and, and see how they work, how they make this stuff. To be honest, mine I didn't want that aged, but after a while just get used to it. And I think um, you think a bit less if you happen to, you know, have a little dent or something on the road that this kind of stuff happens. So I just would like to describe a little bit what's on my Satikoi. I mean, it's pretty straightforward, but of course, as you can see, I have a humbucker pickup on the bridge and I have the push pull so I can, you know, have a single coil and have the full humbucker. Uh, I like the tremolo uh, because I have this like a little rubber thing. So there's no thread on it that, um, you know, maybe it's time to replace that LSL. <laughs> Um, I love the switch, you know, all like a high quality components on it, uh, all the CTS, perhaps period correct, um, you know, to the early kind of uh, strats. Another thing is uh, Deluxe Clusum style uh, machine heads or tuning keys, whatever you call it. One interesting fact about uh, LSL guitars is that whenever you have a custom order or they are building something, they don't really usually use uh, serial numbers. So all the instruments are na actually named after someone of a choice, you know, so um, it's, you know, it's really cool and very personal, you know, and they ask you a lot of, you know, about details, how you want it. If you are looking for uh, an LSL Satikoi, um, I will leave some links below on the description so you can find uh, in some of the shops below. Uh, again, I'm not being paid to make this video. No, this is my personal LSL Satikoi and um, it's been my go-to guitar, uh, my workhorse or whatever you call it. I'm gonna just pretty much set up the guitar and my pedals as I would be performing live. Uh, it's one of my originals, uh, Angel's Crest Highway. I actually wrote that song when I was in LA uh, back in 2018 and um, yeah, so um, I have some delay here, so I'm using my timeline and um, I'm using, uh, I have my first pedal as well, so um, I'm going to kick at some point, so hope you enjoy it.
even though it was a short video, pretty much just me playing one song, not much showcasing what this guitar can do. I'm gonna be using this guitar for the next videos and uh, trying different pedals and different types of settings, possibly different types of amps. So if you like this video, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And if you want more content like this, please don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.